What is up guys, my name is Vikin2002 here, and in this video I'm going to be showing you guys how to glitch any blueprint attachment completely for free on any weapon. You guys can use any weapon for this glitch, whether it's a Vanguard, Cold War, or Modern Warfare weapon, and you'll be able to use them without any trouble in Warzone and Modern Warfare. Now I'm going to be showing a method for console and PC that require no timing, no spamming, and definitely the easiest glitch you guys need to try before it gets patched. Before we get into the video, here's a word from my sponsor. If you guys were wondering how I got Dark Aether and Plague Diamond instantly unlocked, I actually got it done through a service in which you guys can get the same done through Diamond Resupply. Click the link in the description below and use code Vakuna to get 10% off your order on things such as Instant Dark Aether Unlocked, Custom Prestige, Max Ethereum Crystals, and DM Ultra put on your own account. Now this is a trusted service that is unbannable, doesn't require any login info, and takes about 5-10 to 10 minutes of your time, and then you're done. If you have any questions, join their Discord which is linked on their website. And now back to the video. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and start off with the PC method for this glitch. The requirements for this is to have a friend, but if you have a second platform, you can also use that to make it 100% solo. Now you and your friend will need to have Warzone installed and an auto clicker which is also going to be linked in the description below. Keep in mind, you're the only one that needs a mouse and the auto clicker, your friend just needs to help you and have Warzone installed. So, first step is to open your auto clicker. Now if it doesn't work in Warzone, make sure to open it as an administrator and make sure to copy the exact same settings down as I have in the video. Then go into Warzone, pick any class you want to use and remember the loadout number. Place in the weapon you want the blueprint attachments to go onto, either in the primary or secondary slot, and then go into a Warzone private match. Go onto that same class and place in a weapon that has the most blueprints you have unlocked, and then go into the gunsmith. Have your friend sit in a Warzone lobby and send you an invite, accept that invite, and it should just kick you out of the loadout. And simply go back in and go onto that same class. Click on gunsmith and open your auto clicker, set the activation key to your left clicker, and quickly go back into Warzone as you only have around 30 seconds to a minute before it kicks you out. Once the auto clicker is ready, hover over the attachment category and tell your friend to click on any Warzone game mode, and as soon as he tells you you clicked on the game mode, you want to hold down your left clicker completely still until it should glitch out and you should be able to see the attachments. Now at that point, click on the blueprint attachments and pretty much pick and choose which ones you guys want. It should immediately equip in your class and after that you can save it, modify it however way you want, and of course use it in game. Moving on to the console method, you will need a mouse, a friend to help, or a second console to make it 100% solo, but keep in mind that your friend or your console need to be on the same brand console as you. It won't work if you're on PlayStation and your friend is on Xbox, it has to be PlayStation with PlayStation and Xbox with Xbox. The last requirement for this method is for you and your friend to also have Warzone and co-op installed on your consoles. So the first step to this glitch is actually to have a custom mod of the weapon you want the blueprint attachments on, and then go into a private match on Warzone, go into your loadouts, and choose any loadout you want to use for this glitch. Go into your weapon selection for the primary or secondary slot, then hover over the armory option for the weapon you're using, tell your friend to go into a co-op lobby, then invite you, and start searching for a spec ops game mode. Once he does that, you need to hold down on your left clicker on your mouse, and hover over the armory option. Open the invite through your console notifications with your controller and accept the invite. Now pay attention on your screen to the text as once it says joining game session for the second time on the invite, you back out of the invite and then choose the custom mod you made. It should be equipped in your loadout for Modern Warfare and Spec Ops as you see here. Now that you got the weapon transferred into Modern Warfare, simply do the same thing. Go into a Warzone private match, go onto that same loadout but then you're actually going to be changing the weapon to a gun that you have a lot of blueprints for. Go into the gunsmith, hover over the attachment category using your mouse, tell your friend to send you an invite and search for a spec ops game, hold your left clicker on the actual attachment category, then you want to go ahead and join your friend with your controller, and as soon as you see the second joining game session text prompt up on your screen, you're going to want to go ahead and back out of the invite, and it should be prompting up all the attachments. Go ahead and go to the blueprint attachments and basically pick and choose which ones you guys want. Now once you guys are done doing this glitch or choosing attachments, go into a private match in Spec Ops, back out, and you guys will be able to save this as a custom mod or blueprint, and you guys will be able to use it in-game 
game as well. If you have any questions about this glitch, be sure to let me know in the comment section below. And if you guys need anybody to help you, be sure to leave your Activision ID so anyone can help you doing this glitch. Huge shout out to the founders. Be sure to go check them out. Their links will be down in the description below. And yeah, guys, that's going to be it for 2002. Signing out.